Well, we're thrilled to have everyone here, and clearly you have a devoted crowd. I, I see so many beautiful Tops. pieces from so many different collections. I'm sure in Paris you had really at your fingertips some of the finest uh, seamstresses and people with details, no? Everything is done in my own workrooms. The two garments in those back walls, for example, the white dress, those pieces of organza that are all hand pleated as if they're blocks of slate, that's done in Paris by the studio of Jean-Pierre Ollier. But the black suit of pieces of taffeta to look like a Pierre Solange canvas, that's done in my room. Everything is done in our own workrooms. So we have an atelier and workrooms and production workrooms that are individual and for ourselves. I got to New York, I worked for the great, the first job I had was for the great, great, brilliant Halston. And the very first woman I ever saw in his salon we all know Mrs. Barbara Pelly, Dave Pelly they call her, arrived for a fitting wearing a skunk coat inside, and the outside was a silk liner and flannel pant, the chicest thing I've ever seen in my life. I'm diseased with the notions of the finite elements of what she. So, very oddly, my conception of fashion has nothing to do with change but has everything to do with longevity and evolution and perfecting.